Okay, well, a Nissan Charger, uh, not at a Nissan, but a Nissan branded Charger, Chademo Station, uh, yes, it's dark out, that um, I tried yesterday, uh, two days ago, that was offline, is currently online again, apparently they reset it. Now, I want to show why, a reason why, Tesla took so long to make this adapter. Uh, I think it was, what, almost two, a uh, year and a half? I'm um, late, um, two years since promised, a year and a half late coming out, and uh, okay, now a 60 kilowatt Model S, which is what I have, uh, let's see if I can turn on, get night mode on, there we go, it might help a little bit, uh, 60 kilowatt Model S, fully charged battery, 353 volts, a 85 kilowatt Model S, fully charged battery, Probably about 404 to 405 volts, roughly. It's going to be somewhere right around there, plus or minus a volt or two. I'm going to show you why Tesla was so hesitant uh, to allow Chademo, or at least third-party stations. Now, I'm going to try and do this so I can show you. Okay, we're going to start, stop the charging. Okay, charging stopped. All right. Now I'm gonna zoom in if I can. And um, oh, Vinny's already got my iPhone charge. Oh, oh. Reset the station. Okay. Charging started. Now watch. Watch the voltage. Look at that. Over 100 volts higher than what is supposed to be on a fully charged battery. Did you see that? Over 100 volts higher. And uh, on a fully warmed battery, although my pack is you know, 83% full. Uh, we're only at 20, 20 kilowatts on a 44 kilowatt station, which with overhead you'd expect about 40 kilowatts out of. So now that I verified the station is online, Uh, we'll come back tomorrow and fill her up. Come back. I'm not going to charge tonight. Um, got a, little, a few errands to run in the morning and then come back during daylight hours and uh, see what this puppy will put, put out on a, on a more drained battery. Uh -huh. So, anyways, that's why Tesla is so hesitant to allow third parties systems to access the battery pack is for fear that they will dump incorrect voltages and whatnot. That's why they had to build this special adapter that has its own brain inside for communications and whatnot as an as attempt to secure the car and prevent damage. But that over a hundred volts too high. I'm hoping um, and the way it sounded with the contactors and the car clicking it did in fact sound like um, the car segregated the high voltage pack from the Chademo station until that voltage came down to proper level. So thank you Tesla, you guys are amazing. Just imagine all the little Nissan Leaf batteries that are getting cooked by these state Nissan, oh, at least this one, Nissan branded station. But uh, all right, um, coming back tomorrow. I guess that'll be video three of the Chanimo charging series. Just amazing. Smile, cheese.